I'm Ted Geisman. I'm president of Wilder Labeling Systems. And today I'm here to show you the RL840N that you can see over my shoulder in the back. It's a new product for us. For over 20 years, we've been doing pharmaceutical primarily, pressure sensitive labeling. And we decided to take that rotary technology and apply it to a brand new business, which is cut and stack labeling. And cut and stack labeling is traditionally applied with cold glue, but we partner with a company called New Label, who's invented an activatable adhesive. And they apply it to the labels during the manufacture process. And although they look and feel like regular labels, we activate them on the RLA40N to apply them to the bottle with pressure sensitive appearance, but cold glue costs. That wouldn't be possible if we didn't have great technology in this new machine, in this rotary. It's a very, very motor intensive machine that has to be synchronized. We have 24 stepper platforms on the turret of this machine. We have a number of servo motors that drive the turret and drive the cut and stack modules on the machine. And they have to be synchronized with microsecond accuracy. So the machine will behave like a mechanical machine, like a, like a cam machine that's all synchronized together mechanically. And that happens with the BNR technology that we've chosen to use here. It's made possible primarily by the Ethernet power link technology that they have for microsecond communication instead of the traditional millisecond communication. That allows the motors to talk efficiently even through the slip ring of the turret that is used to bring the communication and power up to the motors on the turret. In addition, we can trigger vision and printing with the same technology to get the accuracy that we need for the results on both printing and inspection. One of the independent axes is the feed screw. The feed screws in all rotary machines to bring the product into the star wheel, which is driven by the turret. So the feed screw has to be synchronized perfectly with the star wheel to bring the product into the turret. Another independent axis is the cut and stack module. There are two cut and stack modules on the RLA40N to apply two labels to the bottle, and each of those is driven by a BNR servo motor. They have to be synchronized perfectly with the turret to deliver the label to the bottle in exactly the right location so that the labels are phased exactly where you want them. And with the BNR technology, we can actually have a recipe and control both the phasing of the delivery of the servos and the label to the turret, as well as the rotation of the bottle to make sure that you can get the lineup that you want. If you want to shift the label a 32nd of an inch or two millimeters one way or the other, it's simply done in the HMI to control the motors. That's what the synchronized control does for us. We'll be adding stepper motors to the machine in the future, taking it up to 32, 36, 40 stepper motors and that expansion is easily doable with the BNR platform. I think you'd be excited to find out more about the RL840N that we've developed with new label technology. And if you'd like to learn more, why don't you visit us at www.losetheglue.com.